Hello, I'm Joanne Turner reporting for ECOC TV and I'm at the Market Focus Theatre today talking to Chris Cole from Finisar. Chris, you've just done a great presentation here. It was a packed theatre, standing room only. So why don't you tell us a little bit about what you talked about? Sure. The title of my talk was The Promise of Silicon Photonics and DSP for Nearly Free Cost for Optics. And the basis for that is that both are CMOS technology. And as we know, in many other areas, CMOS is nearly free. So what I talked about is, has it delivered on that promise? Okay, why don't you talk us through some of the examples you gave during your presentation in that area? Yeah. So I looked at some historical examples. The first one was for use of DSP, was 10G LRM, uh, which was actually a successful technical solution. But unfortunately, it took so long to do that by the time the technical solution was worked out, uh, the problem went away. People ripped out old fiber and they didn't need signal processing. Uh, a successful example is 100G Coherent. Uh, there, people didn't actually start out trying to have low cost. It was the only solution to getting 100G through 50 gig channels. However, it turned out that having the flexibility of DSP lowered the operational and installational cost. You didn't need uh, fixed fiber compensation. You could go over different channels. So those are two examples, one successful, one not. There's many others. Okay, so what's the future? Well, I think the key for silicon photonics and DSP is to work on real problems. You don't want to work on me too problems where you're trying, where you have existing solutions that work well and you're saying, gee, I'm going to lower the cost. Come in and solve problems that can't be done the other way. What we think an exciting problem is, is lowering the cost of WDM 100G optics where the traditional approach is the gold box packaging. And if you can move away from that, let's say chip on board, that would be an exciting uh, development. Okay, and Finisar have a great silicon photonics um, demo here this week at the show. Do you want to tell us a bit about that? That's, that's exactly right. We have a 2x50G silicon photonic transceiver. So that is the fastest rate uh, silicon photonics that have been reported. Uh, we're running that over a 10 kilometer link and we're displaying 56 GIs. And if you were to look inside the module, you wouldn't see any gold boxes. It would, in fact, be chip on board. So that is an example of something exciting that silicon photonics can do for the future. Yeah, definitely. Well, thanks for taking the time to talk to us today. Thank you. My pleasure.